So I would like to pick just two technologies on what uh, among the many we have on the LIPEX, just to show you how we are connecting the customer requirement with what we are doing. On the fan blades, for instance, oops, sorry. On the fan blade, for instance, most of, I mean, no, all, almost all the aircraft flying today are using metal fan blades. And by the way, all the, most of the aircraft flying tomorrow are going to use metal fan blades. So several years ago, G engineers came up with a revolutionary technology, which is composite fan blades. And today, we have, I mean, we have built up a significant experience on that. I mean, uh, more than uh, 15 million hours of experience. And this is what I, I can call the first generation of the fan blades, uh, composite fan blades. Then, the snake mine engineers on their side, in this quest to find a lighter solution for the engines, came out and today are working to roll out with the LIPEX, the second generation of the composite fan blade. And for you to, to give you, I mean, the, 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 the clue behind that is, the, 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 the current fan blades uh, behave like a uh, hope, you know. They are very strong to handle all the foreign damage. The new technology, the second generation, will be like bamboo. You know, in, in Asia, bamboo is used to raise building to, to, for the scaffold, you know. It, so the bamboo can be very strong, but at the same time, you can bend it. And when you release the bamboo, it recovers the initial position. This is what the second generation of uh, composite fan blades will be all about. It's the three-dimension woven RTM technologies we are currently rolling out on the LIPEX. And by the way, because, I mean, it's combined the, 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 the solidity of the current fan blades with some elasticity, we are going to be able to produce maintenance-free fan blades. And Another peak in the, uh, in the technology we are uh, developing today is about the thermal machine. Now you know, I mean, the basic principle, so here is the case. 